Hi Dresser Cuties, Whitney here. Today we're going to draw a cute tulip. So let's get started. To draw this cute flower, let's first start by drawing the top of our tulip. So I'm going to start right here and we're going to go up. And basically it's kind of like drawing cat ears. It kind of reminds me of that. So we're going to go up and then we're going to come to a point, but it's going to be rounded off. So it's going to be nice and soft and then we're going to bring it down. So just like a cat's ear. So something like this. And then we're going to draw another one exactly the same. So we're going to go up just like the other side. And since I'm drawing pretty big, I'm just going to drag a point across just so I know approximately the same height on the other side. And then once again, we're just going to bring it down. So it's like an M or two cat ears, right? Stuck together. <laughs> there. Then from there, we're just going to bring it down to draw the body of our tulip flower. So bring it down and bring it down on this side. There. So it's, it doesn't come out very much. It's actually pretty straight down. And then we're just going to draw a big curve for the bottom of our tulip. And connect it all on the bottom right here with a big curve. There, so nice and round. And then let's come back to the top right here in the center and we're going to draw another cat ear right about here and round off the tip and come down right in the center. Then from there, let's find our center. So boom, come all the way down and say about right here, just going to go ahead and we're going to draw the stem. So right there, two little angles and then we're going to bring it down and connect it. So bring it down, straight down and same thing here to give our tulip a stem. And I'm not going to make it too tall, but if you're drawing, when drawing at home, you can make it as tall as you want, but I don't really have a lot of vertical space. So I'm just going to shorten it and about right there. I'm going to come right by here and go across with a line to draw my pot. And then right here, I'm just going to give my pot here a lip. Very simple pot. So I'm just going to draw a soft rectangle right here. And then I'm going to come to in about right here and draw the angle line coming down for the bottom of our pot. So like I said, very simple pot. And then round it off and connect all the way across there. And then from there, let's draw in some leaves. So I'm going to come over here and we're going to draw some really long tulip leaves. So we're going to go up of a curve just to kind of surround our flower and then bring it back down all the way in. And if you like, you can come in here, just draw a center line. And let's draw one more right here. And so same thing, go around your flower. And once again, round off this tip and bring it right back in. There, and then once again, that center line. You, draw, you can draw that with um, your marker when you're coloring or you can draw it with this black Sharpie. I mean, you can make it black with a line or you can... <laughs> I'm sorry. Sometimes when I'm drawing, it's just so hard to talk and draw at the same time. I don't even know what I'm saying. Okay, so there. Um, that is basically it for a tulip flower. And you can bring this all the way down right here with a curve. If you want to just draw a, a simple tulip. But today it's going to be a draw so cute one. So I'm going to put in some eyes and bring it to life. So say about right here, I'm going to go ahead and pop in a big circle. So because I'm putting in these eyes, I'm not going to put in that line right here to divide everything. So let's come across. I think just from the shape, you know, it's a tulip, right? And it's meant to be very cute and cartoonish. So it doesn't have to be too realistic. 
Okay, so we have two big circles in. Let's make them draw so cute eyes with two small circles inside for highlights. And a curved line at the bottom. And shade in the top. And lines at the bottom. And same thing over here. And then let's go ahead and draw a curve over each eye. And of course, a really big smile. So let's in between the eyes, let's say about right here. We go ahead and draw a big curve coming up and cap it off. <laughs> there. Pretty cute, right? Hopefully you think so and that it still looks like a tulip. And then from there, let's add a heart. I'm going to decorate my pot and right here in the center, I'm going to go ahead and just draw a heart to decorate my pot. So a stylish heart <laughs> there. And that is pretty much it for this spring inspired tulip in a pot. I really hope you love how it turned out and I helped you draw this fun and easy today. And if I did, please make sure to give me a like and subscribe so you won't miss any new Drastic videos. See you later.